And so what keeps me coming back to the box is the motivation that everyone brings. Um, it really feels like a community, more like a family when we come here. And it's just so encouraging when you're working out, especially when you're the last one to finish. You can't actually strive to be the last one because of how encouraging and motivating everyone makes you feel to get that workout done to finish. How much of a family it is here. Um, besides CrossFit, CrossFit Cerebral has done so much for us family-wise. We, I have a sister-in-law struggling with breast cancer and they have been behind us since day one. They have done fundraisers and charity events for not only for us, but for other people as well. Um, I think that they really try to help out as much as they possibly can, physical wise, being here at the box, but also on a pers more personal level. What makes CrossFit Sayreville different from other facilities that we've been to is of how when you first join here, they show you the proper form and technique for every exercise that you're eventually going to use in a wad. Um, before coming here, I didn't know I was doing squats or wall balls completely wrong. Um, so when I got here, I was a little shocked and I'm glad that they take that time to show you how to properly perform each skill. Um, I think that's one of the things that actually got me to stay here was that they actually cared about how you worked out and want to see you improve each time you come here. I was looking for something different. I was a, a gymnast for over 10 years and I'm used to sort of those kinds of workouts that really get your body moving, things that show your strength and cardio. And I just needed something different. Those club gyms weren't doing it for me. So I needed something that were gonna fulfill the things that I need in order to improve myself and get fit and healthy. And when I came here, it was a little intimidating at first. I was a little skeptical. I gave it a try. I haven't left ever since. We needed something in town, uh, something that was convenient for our, our work time. You know, I'm, I'm a teacher, so I needed something that would you know, work with my schedule. They have a variety of class times. Um, there's also um, workouts on the weekends in case you know we can't get here during the week and it was just more convenient for me um, to come here. My advice would be you just really honestly sounds very cliche you just have to give it a try. Um, you know I watched videos on Ben's Facebook page because like I said we needed we needed a change we needed something different and I was looking at the videos and I said hmm, you know this could be for me. I told my mom about it she was like oh, I don't know I don't know I said well let's just give it a try we have nothing to lose. We came, we loved it, and we've even brought some friends, um, our friends into it as well, and we just, we just love coming here. Absolutely not, and I could say I kind of was one of them because I never knew what CrossFit was about. Whenever anyone would say the word CrossFit, it's like, whoa, what is that? It's not for me. It's probably all men, all strong people, but honestly, you really, it sounds like repetitive. You have to try it out. You, you have nothing to lose, but so much to gain from it. Um, I like to show people some of my videos that I do here just to give them an idea of what happens and what occurs here. But I would also like them to actually come and try it out. It's, it really, you need to see and feel for it for yourself before you can judge anything. And I think that's what a lot of people need to take on that because when they hear that word, they are already very standoff, standoffish and they are intimidated. But when you come here, it's, it has nothing to do with what they think it is. It is a place to work out. It is a place to have fun. It is a place to get stronger. It is a place to motivate and encourage each other. And I think that's what Cerebral CrossFit does. It's also for a place to just come and hang out. We, you know, we do outside events. We do holiday parties. We do more than just working out. It is a family. And I think a lot of people should just try it out and see for it for themselves before they judge anything. I think my mom and I have always been very close. Uh, we don't have sisters, so as I've gotten older, I feel like we've become more like sisters than a mother and daughter. And she loves hearing that people think she is my sister, um, even though she thinks I, I don't like it, but I love it. Um, but, you know, since I've been married almost seven years, I'm not at the home physically. We talk every day, several times a day. But when we come here, it's a time for us to be together, a time for us to share a passion that we both have. We both want to be fit and healthy, and why not share that passion together? It's great that I have someone like that to support me because there are times where I'm like, oh, I don't really feel like going today or oh, I don't really feel like running or doing burpees. No, no, Amanda, let's go, let's go. And when we're done, she goes, aren't you glad we came? And my answer is always is yes. So I love having my mom with me. She is, she's a lot of fun. Um, <laughs> she's a great motivator. She pushes me, I push her, and we piggyback off each other and it's great.